Good evening, Wendy's. Hello, did, did the Wendy's here? Hello. Me? Is it the Wendy's store? Yeah. All right, I have a little bit of a problem here. I come down down to your place about 35 minutes ago. I purchased myself a number six, and I get got home, and man, I opened up my sandwich, and that, somebody took a bite out of it, and I, I need to know who did it. Someone took a bite out of your sandwich? Yes, ma'am, they did. Now, I'm telling you right now, when I came in there, one of them men back behind the countertop was giving me the funny eye. And I think it was him. I, I don't know why he did it. Um, which Wendy's was this? This is the one down, uh, the, the, uh, right across from the mall. The, right across the, the highway. First Grove Wendy's? Yes, ma'am, it would, and um, I'm fairly upset because I'm telling you, the man that gave me the funny eyes, I mean, if I was a little younger, I'll tell you, I would have hopped over that countertop and I would have given him a walk. Um, okay, hold on one second, I'm getting you mixed up. When you come down again next time, we will give you a free new meal. Well, ma'am, I'm I, I, I'm pretty hungry, so I'm, I think I might come down pretty quickly here. But, but I, I mean, how are you going to take care of it? Because I did come down for two weeks working in Fort McMurray. Yeah. I, I I said, how are we going to handle this, ma'am? I had done just come down from two weeks of Fort McMurray working. I'm, a, I'm pretty hungry. So I come up in there. And and basically what they just did was take the money and hand it feed him. He did bet my burger and I and I need to know who done it. I need to know that he would or whoever done it will be taken care of. Hi, can I get your name, sir? Yes, ma'am. My name is Jim. Jim? Yes, ma'am. Okay, and sir, the complaint was someone took the bite out of your burger, right? Yes, ma'am, it was. And I, I, I do believe it was the man that gave me the funny eyes. The man, I'm telling you. Um, if he's still here, um, I, can you please give me his name? I, I, didn't, I didn't get a chance. He did. He was walking side, like he wasn't facing. He was walking outside. You know how when you come in your restaurant, you have the yeah. bathrooms on the one side. He had been, I don't know, coming through those doors, or he was on that side. He was walking sideways, and I'd come in, and I'd just stand there, and he, he had give me he had give me one of them dare stairs, if you know what I'm saying. Yes, and I'm and, and and I just felt pretty uncomfortable. I, I knew something was up. He he didn't like me from the second I came in there. And I I mean I tell you that man's face. I tell you. Okay. Um. Well, uh, yeah, you can come down, and man the manager here will take care of it. Is there a manager there now I can speak to? Because I, I would like to know who this was. I mean, I know you can't give me no names, and you can't point them out, but I need to know that this suspect will be taken care of, because, yeah. Yeah, I mean, if it wasn't for a customer, he wouldn't be working, period, if you know what I'm saying. Yeah. And I tell you right now, if I wasn't a 65-year-old man with a bad hip, I would have hopped over that counter. Yeah. <laughs> Okay, well, if you come now, I'm sure an owner will take care of it instead of a manager. Is there an owner there now? Pardon me? Is there an owner there now? Yeah, there's an owner morning shift and day shift and night shift. Is there, is there one I can speak to right now? Yeah. Um, actually, they're all in the meeting right now, but if you come down, I'm sure there'll be other All right, Mike. And, and are, you, are you a super manager or one of them, one of them high uppers? Pardon me? Are you one of them high uppers? Um, no, I am, uh, the owner's daughter. Okay. Now, now, do you know, do you, I, I, like I said, I was there about 35, I, not too, not too, too long ago, I mean, I had to do a fair drive bit there and back, but I mean, had their people been there and left already within that 35, 40 minute span? Like, um, a, like, a, some, I mean, has somebody been off their shift in the last 30, 45 minutes? Uh, no. So the person's still there, but you're telling me. Yeah. All right, then. Now, I need to die. Now, if you can make me a promise that you go down there when I'm off the phone with you, because I don't feel too... I'm an older man, and you know, the young ones nowadays, I don't I don't trust them too much, especially the funny-eyed ones. I need to... I don't want to come down there and have to will be watching my back, if you know what I'm saying. No, um, um, I will meet you at the phone counter, because that's probably going to be here for a bit anyway. That's, meet you at the phone counter, and that, that sounds, and that sounds good. Now, okay. t now t I tell you right now, I don't, I don't want no trouble, funny business, okay? 
I mean, I know, I know you won't be giving me no funny business, but I, I mean, I mean the one that bit out my sandwich. I know, I know he, I know he'll know when I get there, and he, I, but I know he'll know. So I need you to tell him to just keep his distance, because I might just hop over. Okay. All right, I'll see you soon. Thank you very much, ma'am. No problem. Bye bye. Bye bye. Oh my. <laughs>